to introduce you to Dr. Christy Funk. She's the director of Pink Lotus Center. And I want to know if any of you have any embarrassing questions about your breasts. OK, what's your name? Jennifer. Jennifer? OK. Woo! Woo! Sorry. I it's easier. OK, it's just easier. OK, so I have a question about inverted nipples. So what do you do to make them pop out? <laughs> Really? Yeah. It's flat? Yeah, totally, uh, totally flat, totally boring. You have an innie. You have yeah, innies. I mean, I, yeah. <laughs> Talk about any bellies. I got an innie nipple. Dr. Funk. <laughs> Dr. Funk. She doesn't want to fake the funk. What All does right. she have to do? <laughs> well, Jennifer, you're not alone. About 2% of women have inverted nipples. Uh, I think we have a diagram so I can explain this to you a little better. So this is a picture of the breast. All of those little lines that are right under the nipple in that picture are ducts that usually can carry milk from the lobule out to the world. Those ducts are a part of the nipple. So for whatever reason, they get a little short and thick. They scrunch in, and your nipple just goes on with it like a belly button. Do you feel self-conscious about it? Is yeah, it affecting? Yeah, sometimes, totally, yeah. In your relation, are you in a relationship? Yes. So does it bother your partner? No. Oh. Um, oh so what is she supposed to do to get it out? To go from in to out, there's a really quick 20-minute outpatient procedure that I can do where you make a little incision, and those ducts that are just too short, we Cut them and poop, pops right out. So it's a surgical thing, so that's your there decision. You, go. you, you good? Yes, thank you. You're thank welcome. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, we also have Courtney Z. Here's Courtney. You have a question. Okay. What is a normal size for an areola? Does normal everybody size? know what an areola is? Because I like, that's, <laughs> let okay. me tell you. No, I didn't know that like a couple of years ago. I'm not good on lingo. Okay, so that's the round, that's so, the pancake. <laughs> The pancake around the chocolate chip in the middle. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the average adult woman has a one and a half inch diameter across area. About an Oreo cookie. An or I'd like to see the. I have a tray of cookies because I think I'm a Nilla wafer. <laughs> what are you? I'm an Oreo. You're an Oreo. <laughs> I feel like there are some people that are Mrs. Fields. I feel. You know, I've seen women who are the dinner plate. Really? Yeah. The whole cookie tray. All right. Hi. Hello. So that's you? Oh, hold on. Would you hold my microphone for a second? So that's you? You're an Oreo? A little, little bigger? You're a Chips Ahoy. Yeah. I am a I'm Nilla wafer. So which of these, an Oreo is the most common? Yes. So, that's, so this is normal. So what, what, do you, what do you do if you don't want this? Right. If, if you want to trade your chocolate chip for an Oreo, there is another simple outpatient operation whereby you remove the pigment and skin that you don't want and just make it smaller. You get to pick your cookie. Are you happy? With, are you happy with your cookie? I'm happy with my cookie. Then eat it. Then eat your, eat your cookie. Yes. Awesome. And now we have someone else, Jennifer K. Jennifer K. Okay. Would you like an Oreola? Okay. So, hi. Thanks, Kevin. Single, just letting everyone know. <laughs> okay. Sorry. There you go. Okay. So I was thinking about getting breast implants, and I was wondering what kind I should get and how big I should go. Uh, All right. Are there still two different types? Only two types to choose from. Saline, which is filled with salt water, or silicone, which is filled with a sticky gel. Neither is dangerous. Neither causes cancer. Word on the street is that silicone has a softer, more natural look and feel. But I'll tell you, if it ruptures, it's a way bigger mess than saline. We which is less expensive? Oh, they're equal. They are equal. Mm -hmm. OK, and then what size are you now? I'm a small A. <laughs> You're a small A. And what do you want to do? A lot of padding. What do you think you want to do? Oh, like a B. I don't you want to do go. Like a large B? Yeah. Yeah, B plus. B plus. Yeah. You're an A minus, and you want to be a B plus. I'm okay. Okay. Happy. Excellent. <laughs> um, okay, we're coming back with more bosoms. Yeah.